Welcome to Wild Breakaway alongside Tom Torski. I'm Audra Martin. The Wild wrapped up a four game road trip tonight in Buffalo with two very big points. They started things out a few nights ago with a shutout win over Boston. They finished it up with yet another shutout win tonight against the Sabres. A perfect performance yet again from Devin Dubnik between the pipes and another well balanced scoring attack from the Wild. Yeah, and they executed when they had to. It was uh, a night where the Wild were outshot, they were out hit, they were lost in the faceoff circle. But Devin Dubnik made the saves when he had to, and the players executed when they had opportunities. Uh, they continue to get breakaways, uh, draw penalties on some of them, no uh, penalty shots yet, to, much to the dismay of, of Coach Boudreau, but uh, this team is finding ways to win, and tonight, most importantly, they got off to a good start in the first period. And now every single wild skater has at least one point on the season so far. Here's the game summary from tonight. Everything in favor of the Sabres. Shots 38-22 to 22 over the Wild. 20 hits to the Wild 7. Look at the faceoff circle just completely dominating in the circle over the Wild, but it all still comes together for a 4 nothing win for the Wild. How about that penalty kill for the Wild? Now perfect 9-for-9 nine nine on the road trip. Here's what the head coach had to say about that. They had some chances on the on the first power play. I think the second power play they had, we were more of a demoralizing fact to them, and it, and it got our group going more than it got their group going. Here's a look at what's in store for the Minnesota Wild. They now return home to take on the Dallas Stars this Saturday at 6.30. And then just a few days later, we'll once again see the Buffalo Sabres on home ice. That's Tuesday night. But start with the Dallas Stars. This is a team that last year took a hold of the, the division pretty much from the beginning of the season and never looked back. Not quite playing up to those standards so far into the season, but still have a ton of weapons, so you got to be ready. Yeah, the one-two punch of Tyler Sagan and Jamie Benn, and you got Klingberg on the back end who uh, kind of – tormented the Wild as, as well, especially in overtime. Uh, Wild are going to want to get off to a quick start the way they did tonight and carry some of this momentum with the last two wins. They can beat uh, the Stars. They can uh, maybe beat Buffalo uh, the following game, and now they've put together a nice little winning streak. So that'll be on their mind, I think. Well, we'll see if they can get the job done, pick up a two big points over a Central Division fill in the Dallas Stars. We look forward to seeing you 6.30 on Saturday. In the meantime, for Tom Chorsky, I'm Audra Martin. Thanks for joining us on tonight's Wild Breakaway.